It's not unusual to find a dog on a train in New York City, but riders say a pit bull attacking a passenger is beyond crossing the line. Okay, just get the dog on the line. I am as outraged as anyone when I saw that. MTA Chairman Joe Loda says the Transportation Authority and the NYPD are investigating the attack. Passenger Taisi King recorded it with his phone. He says the pit bull went after the woman here in the red jacket as she was arguing with its owner about the dog sitting on the bench next to her. She's like, the dog don't belong on the seat. He's like, I'm not moving my dog. She pushes it. Um, what is this dog doing on the chair? He's jumping on her, but she moves back. And that's when he catches a hold of her shoe and he was not letting it go. Hey, Chairman Loda made no excuses when we asked how the dog got on the train. There's no reason in the world why that dog was allowed, one, on board, down to the platform, on the train, but let alone uh, harassing one of my passengers. MTA rules prohibit animals on mass transit unless they are enclosed in a container or are a licensed service animal harnessed or leashed. The NYPD and transit workers are responsible for enforcing the regulations, but riders have captured many instances where animals are easily getting on board without detection. It's not even like a, a retriever or a la, uh, that's uh, helping like a blind person. I don't even know how a pit bull gets on the train. Lack of uh, police enforcement at the station. I know the NY NYPD is focused on that now. Uh, I also know that our employees are aware of what the rules are. In 2017, police issued 85 summonses to riders for having an unauthorized animal on a subway or bus. 20 riders have been busted so far this year. The penalty, a $25 fine, which some might say isn't much of a deterrent.